Good evening. Good evening, guys. How are you? Good evening, teacher. <laughs> yes. It's good to see you here, guys. How are you? Hi. It's raining here. Yes, it's raining a lot. I just came home a minute ago. I got all wet. <laughs> yes, but we are here, right? I see just a few students. Let's wait for, for more the students. I hope they can connect to the class. Or maybe they want to watch La Selecta. <laughs> Are you a fan of La Selecta? Yes, of course. Yes, of course. <laughs> okay. So Alfredo is going to tell us how the game is going. I think it has just started. Okay, guys, I'm going to start taking the attendance. So let's see. We have. Okay. Just give me one second because this is loading. Okay, so it's October 7th. Thursday, October 7th. Alba Vides? Present teacher. Alfredo Rojas? Present teacher. Amir Carcañengues? Carlos Gualberto? Present. Cristina Romero? Um, Domingo González. Present teacher. Fátima Portillo. José Matías Lemu. Present teacher. Oh, I I'm thought you here. were watching the game. <laughs> In the stadium. <laughs> Marco Velázquez. Present. Marlon Cardona. I am sick. Mauricio Mahano. Maydeli Judith. Nancy Lisset. Present teacher. Very good. Rocio Martinez. Salvador Escobar. Sandra Yamilet Velázquez. Víctor Salazar, Walter Daniel González, William Eduardo Pérez, and Jasmine Melanie Lemus. Okay, thank you so much. Only eight students. Yes, only eight. Only eight students. I'm gonna cry today. The rain. Because of the rain, yes, it's raining really hard. It was difficult to get home. I have to, yeah, I mean, 
for it was difficult for me. I can imagine that for everyone it was difficult too. Present Walter Daniel in the chat. Yeah, he said just press. And Nancy said. <laughs> El partido tiene la culpa. Yeah, yeah <laughs> the soccer game, the soccer match, but also also the 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 rain the rain okay so here we go today is our video conference number 15 no i'm sorry 16 16 video conference 16 What is the topic of the class? Jose Matias? And the topic? Uh, accounting vocabulary. Yes, accounting vocabulary. And the objective? And participants will be able to write adjective about the object and then people relate to accounting by also reading some sentences correctly in groups. Yes, by writing some sentences correctly in groups. Agenda, Mr. Walberto Rodriguez, can you please read the activities in the agenda? Warm up, tic tac, toy. Activity one, vocabulary. Activity two, fair work, incomes, and outcomes. Activity three, so and such. Activity four, listening, practice, wrap up. Thank you, excellent reading, Mr. Rodriguez. So let's begin with the warm up. The warm up is called tic-tac-toe. Have you played tic-tac-toe before? No? X zero. No teacher. In Spanish, X zero. <laughs> yes. Okay. In English, is tic tac toe. Okay. So we need to have two groups to play this game. One group is gonna be the X, and the other group will be the O. Okay. So we have four and four. Let's see. Alba. Alfredo, Matias, and Domingo are what the X. Okay? Domingo, Matias, Alba, and Alfredo. Nancy, Walter, Marco, and Carlos Walberto, you are going to be the O's. Okay? The O's. Ready? To play tic tac toe? Yes. Okay, the instructions are these guys. Um, each verb has a, a verb. For example, if you want to place the X here, this grid, this is number one. Okay, take is number one. Pay is number two, half is number three, B is number four, buy five, six eat, seven find, A give, and nine no. These words are in the present or in the past, guys? The present. Present. Yes. yes. Okay, it's in the present. You have to tell me the past tense of these verbs and also you have to say one sentence. If you say it correctly, then um, you, are, you can play the X or the O. Ready? So let's start with the X. Which number do you want, X? 
Number. Yes. Four. Number four. four. Okay. B. Five. What is the puzzle B? Ah, oh, number what? four or five? Four. Number four. Okay. B. What is the puzzle B? Was. Was. Was and where. Where. Okay. Can you tell me one sentence using was or where? Uh, you did. You did was. Uh, no, Matias. Oh. You, when you use was, you don't have to use did. Oh, 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 okay. And just ahead. Uh, you were uh, you. You I were was in the in the in the work in the morning. I was at work in the morning. Okay. Yes, it's correct. Okay. O's. O's, or the other group? Number one. Number one, take. What is the pass of take? Look. I'm sorry, can you repeat? Took. Took, okay. And, um, Okay, took. And what is the what is the sentence that you can make with with took? I I took um, a cup of coffee every morning. Okay, when you when you uh, take in this case, it's not the meaning uh, of yes. beber. Is take, I mean, tomar o agarrar. Ah, oh. uh -huh, yes, yes. For example, I took a shower before the class. Yeah, I took a shower before the class because I got wet because of the rain. I took a shower. <laughs> correctly. So you have to say a sentence correctly with took. Okay. You have five, five seconds. Five. Four. Four group. Three. Five. Two. One. I'm sorry, time is over. The other group? Five. You can you can steal the point. Pueden robar el punto. You can steal the the turn. Uh, Pueden robar oh. el turno. If you say the sentence correctly. You take. Say no. We took. It has to be we took. Two. Okay. I took. I took. I Pencil the tools in, tools at the work. I'm sorry, can, uh, you have three seconds. Who is going to say it, Matias or Alfredo? Alfredo, you ready? I took the book in the bookstore. Okay. Hoy nos toca a nosotros otra vez, ¿verdad, Tiki? Yes. yes. Y Bye. ganamos. I don't know. It depends if you say the... Fine. Number seven. Number seven. Fine. What is the pass of fine? Found. Found. Okay. Give me one sentence with found. But not Alfredo, another person in the group. <laughs> Vamos, Matías, tú puedes. Let's go. Don't understand. Uh, phone. Um, phone. Buscar. Okay. I phone uh, the number telephone of Alfredo. <laughs> Can you repeat, please? <laughs> I phone the number. Uh, of telephone, Alfredo. Okay, you found Alfredo's number in the WhatsApp group. Okay. Yes. 
Very good. Okay, so we have the first winners. But don't worry, O's, you still have another opportunity in the next, in the next tic-tac-toe, okay? The revenge. Tic-tac-toe. <laughs> revenge. Now you are going to be, okay, it's the same, X and O's, but we are going to start with the O's. O's, please, choose a number. Nancy, Marco, Carlos, and Walter. Bon teacher. What, what, which number? Uh, five. Number five, draw. This is already in the past. Now, Nancy, you have to say a sentence with throw. Room. I'm sorry? Room. Okay, number five. The verb is already in the past. These verbs are in the past and they are irregular. Fought, knew, yes. went, began, grow, ran, saw, wore, and bought. Tengo que traducirlo en el verbo presente. No, you have to say a sentence with the verb. Tiene que decir una oración con el verbo en pasado. En pasado. She. Eh, eh, she run the park. Okay, by which number did you choose? Five or six? Five. Number five, okay. Number five is draw. 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 Ah, no, teacher, es, es la seis. Es ah, one. okay. Six. Six. Estoy viendo. Ajá, uh -huh. six. Run in the park. Okay, yeah, it's correct. Now, X, which number do you want? I draw. Number five, uh huh. Yes. I draw uh, in the morning from my work. I draw to my work in the morning, okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> um. Domingo, are you X or O? X, right? Uh, Domingo is my own. number one. Let's give yes. him the, 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 the opportunity. Okay, number one, fought. <clears throat> fought is the past of fight. Like is the pow. Pot. Give me one sentence with pot. Pow. I fall in the school. I I fall. Your friend. I fought with my friend. I fought with your friend. Uh -huh. Okay. ¿Cómo sería? ¿Sí sería? Yo me peleo con mis amigos. Con Yo peleé. Yo peleé con mi amigo. I, ah, it's over. I fought I with fight. my friend. Okay. Friend. X, number? Three. Three. In, uh, number three. Went. went. I went to the beach the last weekend. I went to the beach last weekend, okay? 
O's, O's. Be careful, be careful. Seven, seven. Number seven, so, okay? I saw a lot of beer. Yesterday. A lot of beer yesterday. Okay. X, X. Still have opportunity. O's and X. <laughs> Uh, number four began. Okay. I began. I began this this factory. I began. I began this work last year. Okay, you began in the word last year. Let me put more volume because I can hear you. <laughs> Very well. Okay. Yeah, it's correct. O's. Yeah, we still have opportunity. O's and X. A. Okay, word. Work. I wore a dress. Yeah, very good. I wore a dress for the party. Okay. X. Nine. Nine. Okay. I bought motorcycle. Okay. Okay, this one was more difficult. <laughs> but yeah, guys, you practice. You practice the past things. And that, and that is the important thing. Very good. So let's continue with, um, with the other part of the class. Okay, now guys, today we are going we are going to learn a lot of things. So that's why I want to start right now. Uh, the topic is financial statements. Do you know what a financial statement is? Financial statement. Vaya, ¿qué, so, ¿qué es financial statement? Aquí tengo un, un definition for you. What are financial statements? Can somebody read, please? ¿Puede alguien leer? Financial statements are writing records that convey, convey the, uh, the business activities in the financial performance of a company. Financial statements are often audited, audited by government agencies, accountants, firms to ensure accuracy in for tax financing or investing purpose. Financial statements include balance sheet, sheet, income statement, cash flow statement. Okay, so financial statements are records that convey or um, re reports of the business activities of a company. Okay, like balance sheet, income statement and cash, cash flow statements. So that is the, the, the vocabulary we are going to learn today. Okay? So you have to tell me what is the correct answer. For example, cash flow, income statement, equity statement, and balance sheet. Balance sheet. Can you please repeat after me? Cash flow. Cash flow. Cash flow. Income statements. Income, income statement. statement. 
equity statement, equity statement, and balance sheet. And balance, balance sheet. sheet. Okay, I will give you a minute to think about the meaning of these uh, definitions, and you have to match the letter. You have to match the letter, the, the financial statement, with the definition. Okay. I'm gonna give you one moment to do this. Read, analyze, and try to identify with what is the, the answer for each, okay? The teacher. Think about it, please. Think about it, read and think about it. Number three, letter A, letter A. Okay, cash flow, reports on a company's incoming and outcoming of cash, its operating, investing, and financing activities. Very good. Okay, what about income statements? Number three, containment. Number three. Okay, let's see income statement. No, cash flow is number three. Income uh, statement is? Number one. Um, Mm -hmm. No. No. Estamos mal, no lo entendemos. Number four. Number four. Summarizes a company's income, expenses, and profits over a period of time. Yes. Number one, teacher. Okay, cash flow. Cash flow refers to number three. Yes, reports on companies income and income in mm. and outcoming of cash. It's operating, investing, and financing activities. Mm. Income statements summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. Equity statement. Number is, true. It's number one. <laughs> Reports mad, on the mad. changes in retained <laughs> earnings of a company during the stated period. And balance sheet no, refers to reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owner's quality at a given point in time. Very easy to teach. <laughs> Don't worry. Anyways, um, look at this. Me aquí les puse una definición. Perdona, no te. Uy. <laughs> Perdona, se cayó. <laughs> Espérame, señor. Ahí está. What is a business asset? A business asset is an item of value owned by a company. Business assets spend many categories. They can be physical, tangible, goods such as vehicles, real estate, computers, 
office furniture and other fixtures or intangible items such as intellectual property. So a business asset is an item of value owned by a company. Mm -hmm. And that is what the balance sheet reports. Los bienes o los activos de una compañía. Y eso se, re, se refleja en un balance. No sé si alguien aquí trabaja en contabilidad. No, está ahora el que trabaja en contabilidad. Ah, ok. Bye. Cañengue. Ah, Mr. Cañengue. Ok, what about liabilities? Liability. What is li liability? The state Teacher. of being responsible for something, especially by law. It's a, uh, some synonyms of accountability, responsibility, or legal responsibility. Oh. Yeah, somebody say, teacher. Um, is the balance is cheap? Balance is cheap or balance is cheap? Balance sheet. Balance sheet. Yes. Balance sheet. En español se dice hoja o, o solo balance. Ajá, hoja de balance o un balance. Me uh reporte -huh. el balance que se hace en una empresa. El balance en general. Uh -huh. Sí, ¿Qué? los balances generales uh -huh. que se hacen al final de mes, a veces o a finales de un periodo específico. Uh -huh. Ok, so now guys. Ah, bueno, sí, ya lo leímos. Ok, incomes and outcomes. Here we have some questions to discuss. Sí, pero de ahí yo he quedado bien, 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 bien perdido. Full perdido. It's because it's technical vocabulary. But it's just vocabulary for you to know more. I mean, yeah. Uh, technical vocabulary for accounting. Right. Para la contabilidad. Right. ¿Qué es cash flow? Cash flow. The money. The cash. What, Lujo. What, what gets into the company and what it goes out of the company. Gastón. El flujo de... En efectivo. El flujo de dinero. Exactly. El movimiento de la plata. Mm. <laughs> Vaya. El río por donde corre el billete. ¿Sí? Uh -huh. Income statement. It's what, lo que entra, los, los ingresos. Ingreso, ok. Y ¿Cuál es el statement? En lo que se uh -huh. gasta el dinero, no. It says, reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during the stated period. Reporta los, los cambios de dinero retenido de una compañera, de una compañía durante un periodo establecido. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Very good. Now, you have to discuss with a partner the following ideas. Share your opinion and give reasons. We are going to do it as a class. It's not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes a company has. Last year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. It is mandatory for everybody to check on his or her profit to see how much can be invested or spent. Okay, I will send you to breakout rooms for you to discuss these ideas with a partner. Okay, can somebody tell me what is the point number one? Cash flow. Vaya, miren. ¿Qué van a hacer? Van a decir sus ideas, su opinión. Sobre, estos, sobre estas ideas que están acá, van a dar su opinión y de eso van a conversar con su compañero. Aquí dice, no es, no es tan importante conocer los ingresos y los egresos de una compañía. Bien. ¿Qué piensa usted? No, number two. El año pasado, el dueño de una compañía despidió muchas personas. 
¿Lo hizo o llevó a cabo esas acciones para salvar la compañía? El number three. Es muy importante que cada uno evalúe o esté pendiente de sus ingresos, de sus, eh, ¿cómo se dice? Eh, lo, lo, de lo que gana. ¿Cuál es esa otra palabra? Sus... Ay, es esta, estado de cuenta. No. Salario. Eh, Salario. Las ganancias. Ingresos. De sus ganancias. Ingres. De sus ganancias. Ingres. Profits. Para ver cuánto puede invertir o gastar. So you're going to talk about this in your groups. Okay. Aunque aquí, se, aquí está enfocado a una empresa, empresa ustedes también lo pueden hacer como de forma personal. Si sí, quizás no en su trabajo o no tiene mucha relación con la contabilidad, pero todos, todos, todos manejamos un presupuesto personal o familiar. Para la casa. Right? Ah, entonces, pueden hablar sobre eso. ¿Cómo usted, how do you manage your money? Your budget in your family or personal. ¿Cómo personal. utilizamos el dinero? How do you use it? How do you manage it? ¿Cómo lo organizan? Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Because everybody has two. Ok. Let's talk about it. No gastar dinero por gusto. Y de repente ve uno en un chaleco para perro. Hay que comprarlo. <laughs> Okay, talk about it in your groups. Estoy perdido. Hi, teacher. Hello. Uh, Yo tengo dos lados, a personal o de empresa. Cualquiera de los dejamos. That question don't be on the menu. Uh, can you repeat, please? If that questions that you share with us, don't stay in the menu. Manuel. Ah. Yes, in the page 39. Yes, it is. page 39. It is. It is. Yeah. yeah, but anyways, I'm gonna send it to you, okay? On WhatsApp. Ah, yeah, I found it. You found it. In, the, in another page. Sorry. Don't okay. worry, don't worry. Yeah, uh, I think that the number one, if it is not so important to know about the income and outcomes a company has, for me, yes, it's very important because that is the dependent owner. the life of the company and we that form we will be we will be 
work. I don't know what things uh, the other com uh, other Classes. partners. Okay, partners. Alfredo, Alba, Marlon. Mm, I think Marlon. the same. Yes, important. <laughs> Ok, guys. Domingo, ¿con quién está? está? Vamos a ver. Con Cristina. Pero ella está de oyente. Desde hoy estaba con otra persona. Ah. Entonces uh -huh. le fue el... Habíamos dos o tres. Tres sabemos. Le voy a pasar a alguien. Por... Ah. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? Está bien así. Así quiere estar. Ah, ajá. No, está bien. Le voy a mandar. Ok. Después, Matías. Yes. <laughs> I sent him to another group because um, Domingo was alone. Oh. The other person was oyente and he, he didn't have a partner to talk to. So I'm so sorry, but at least you have Nancy. Nancy. Okay. Oh, she's not here. Hello, hello. Talk to Alberto, please. I hear you, Nancy. Hello, hello, teacher. Uh, tell me about your experience. Okay, guys, um, I, I have a question. I, I'm gonna send you to someone who's very, very good at this. Alguien que sabe de dinero. <laughs> okay, Nancy, do you work? Yes, right? You work for a building company, a construction company. <laughs> Do you receive a salary? Yes, teacher. Okay, how do you do you know how much you spend every month or every week? Do you know how much quanto? How much money do you spend every week or every month? Hey, or you, Walberto? Yes, teacher. I know how how spend the money. <laughs> you don't know how you how you spend your money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is very difficult to to organize your finances. It's very difficult. Yes, because you can have one hundred dollars today. 
and you can have like just five dollars tomorrow <laughs> it's very easy to spend the money so easy like water in your hand yeah but in, my, in yes. a company you have to be very careful with that okay they they record every single cent they they use right and we should do the same we should uh, we should be aware, okay? Ser conscientes, we should be aware of how much we spend every day. Yes. Okay. I, I only know, <laughs> I only know the, uh, my salary, I, I win, I won in the, in the month, I spend in the month. <laughs> And do you get paid monthly or monthly? So you get one salary per month. No. Um, or twice two, a month. Every fifteen. Two salary, days. two salary in the month. Okay, every fifteen days. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Every fifteen days. Okay, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> I only get one, I mean, I, I get paid once a month, once a month. Once a month. Ooh. Yes. Do you know yeah. how I spend? <laughs> I have to organize my, I mean, I have organize. my expenses. Yes. I know how much I can spend in the supermarket every week. I also... Uh, put apart the money for the bus, for the transportation, for my cell phone, for the internet, for the house, renting house, but medicine because I have to buy some medicine. But imagine sometimes it's like, oh, I when you get paid once a month, you feel like you receive a lot of money, right? But then, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> but then you don't know where it goes. Do. You see, you see nothing in, in the hands. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Okay. Let's go to the principal, the main station. Okay. Okay, guys, thank you for discussing and giving your opinions. It was a very interesting topic. I would like to know what do you think about this? Number one, it's not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes that a company has. What do you think? It is not so important or it is very important? Yes, it is, teacher. It is very important, okay? That is the purpose of a company. <laughs> and yeah. that is the way it works, right? And the same happens in, in your personal finances. Um, you have to know how much you get and how much you spend, okay? <laughs> we were talking with Carlos, the difference when you get paid twice a month and when you get paid once a month. 
how how many uh, how how many times do you get paid in the month twice or once twice every 15 days al 15 okay in my case i get paid once a month once a month well wow. yes once a we, month. One Friday, yes. One Friday. One Friday no. Ah, okay. Uh, Interesting. That's nice. That's nice. Okay, number two. Last year, a company's owner fired many people. Despidió a muchas personas. The owner carried such actions to save the company. What do you think about that? Recorte de personal. Opinion. Uh, Reactions, comments? Yeah, and my company, About. yes. Yes, I did. Yes, they did on my company fry money of people. Okay. Uh, it's a bad, a bad signal because maybe the company is near to close. To bankrupt. La bancarrota. Bank it, it, it is necessary to continue working. Mm, uh -huh. Okay. Um, I think that sometimes the company, in my opinion, the company has to take other actions. I think it, it is not good to fire many people. I think it's better to to take other options. Okay, that's my opinion. Okay, to save the company, I think you have to take other actions. Number three, it is mandatory for everybody to check on his or her profits to see how much can be invested or spent. Is this in? What do you do you think about this? What's your opinion? Reactions, opinions. I don't know. Okay. It, it depends, teacher, because if you are a um, um, trabajador, worker, employee, employee, if you are employee or you are business owner, business owner, yeah, because are two two places different okay to different positions right position okay. yeah okay yeah you're right that's why i was telling you that because the majority of us are not business person business people but we we get our profits or our incomes when we get paid cuando nos pagame, when we get paid or when we get our salary mm -hmm. and i mean for our uh, financial health para nuestra salud financiera. It is important to to know how much you spend, and and so um, it is important to know how much you get so that you know, right? Okay, I have three hundred dollars, and I have to organize those three hundred dollars, okay, for fifteen days or for one month, okay. Good. Now, guys, we are going to learn about the use of so and such. Okay. Attend that teacher. Oh, yes. It's time for the attendance. Thank you, Matias, for reminding me. Reminding me. No. Okay. Por recordarme. Sí, sí, sí. Remind. Sí, sí. Sí, sí. <laughs> sí teacher. Yo no había escuchado la palabra bien. Remind. Yo pensé que era remember me. <laughs> Teacher, what is the difference between remind and remember? Ajá, eso, pero yo pensé okay. que era remember me. Remember, me. remember not is in past. Remember me, recuérdame. O mm. remember that, recuerda tal cosa. Y en este caso, gracias por recordarme. Ok, Gracias. Okay. 
Sí, ajá, muy bien, Marco. Vaya, ¿cómo les explico? Ay, porque en español es como casi igual. En español se, se traducen y lo usa, usamos como el mismo verbo. O es sea, que como, como que era, fue, como que fue reme, reminding me, por recordármelo, digamos. Ajá, remind es como recordar. Ajá, o sea, ya lo, ya lo sabe, pero lo recuerda. Remind. Eh, y remember es como... Es más general. Sí, es como en general. Ajá. Remember es como quizás no, 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 no lo sabe, pero le está diciendo, ¿verdad? Que, que recuerde algo. Tal vez sobre los hechos ocurridos, eh, si le han olvidado o algo que tiene que recordar. Pero remind es acuerde, acordarse, acordarse, acordarse. Gracias o recordármelo. Por... O recordármelo. Y remember, bueno, también es acordarse de algo. <risa> no, te la carita que es la teacher. La carita que es la teacher. La carita que Yo lo entiendo, pero, de que... <risa> pero no sé cómo explicárselo. Vaya, miren, le voy a poner un ejemplo. No es lo mismo decirles remind me que remember me. ¿Por qué? Porque si yo les digo remember me, remember. Es recuérdeme. Me. Es así como a, recu... como, ajá, que, como, como que a... yo me acuerde de usted. Ajá, ajá acuérdese de mí, remember ajá. me, please. Okay. Así como le dije. Remember que I was your teacher. Ajá, suerte. Remember me, teacher. Y como, como, pues sí, acuérdese de mí cuando allá viaje, ¿verdad? Suiza, Francia, Ajá. Italia, ¿verdad? Acuérdese que tuvo una, una maestra de inglés que le trae un regalito, ¿verdad? Sí. <ríe> y remind es como recordarle a alguien de algo. Remind me es como, me acordás, mira, y me acordás de, de, de pagar la luz. Remind me to pay the, the, electricity, the electricity bill. Ajá, ya lo entendí. Hoy sí. Remember, para, remember es personal, ¿verdad? Y remind me, reminding es de algo. Sí, creo que Walberto captó la idea de, de cómo acordarse de algo. Remember, por ejemplo, I remember that when I was a child. Me acuerdo que cuando yo estaba chiquita, ¿verdad? Y así. But sí, remind, I, re, I, rem, I remember last, last night. Is the, the, the moon. Grande. You saw the moon. No, the moon the grande. The moon was big. The luna grande. La luna grande. The moon. How shiny the moon. <laughs> but, but, remind, but remind is como, como recordarle a algo, algo a alguien. Mm -hmm. Depende de la acción que esté haciendo. <clears throat> Sí, depende de, 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 del contexto. Y de, 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 pues sí, de lo que usted quiera, qué es lo que quiera que usted que la persona haga. Y del recuerdo que tenga. Ah, remember es como de recuerdos. Eso, Ajá, bien, de recuerdos. recuerdos sí. El remind no es acordarse. De algo, de cosas. Acordarse, muy bien. I know. Atenda, teacher. Atenda. Atenda. Thank you for reminding me that I have to. <laughs> que se hacen preguntas bien difíciles. Okay. But that's good because you made me think. Alba Dinora. Alfredo, yes. Alfredo Alexander. Present. Amir Carcañengues, Mr. Cañengues, y ahí me escribió que él se iba a conectar y que quería estudiar para la clase, but I don't know, something, ah, me escribió, ya me acordé, que no, there is no electricity in his house. Ok, Cristina Roxana. Domingo. Está bien repartido ahorita. Trece, trece. Present, ok, Domingo. 13. Fátima. Present. Matías Lemus. Here. Marco. Present. Marlon. Ahí lo acabo de ver conectado, de hecho. Yeah. Yeah, I, I saw him too. Anda tomando agua. Tío. Ahí está, de oyente. 
Está Carlos. Partido. No mencioné a Carlos Alberto. Oh. No, le... lo men... no lo mencioné. Ya le, ya le iba a decir, no. se lo comió. Perdón, no. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. <risa> Mauricio, Alexander. <risa> Ah, ahí sí me puede decir mi remember, sí, remember me, me. Remember me, teacher. <laughs> remember to say my name. Ok. Yes. Ese sí, mire, ese sí. Ok, ya ven. Ya aprendieron. Remember and remind. My daily. Acabo Nan de Nancy. No. Rocío. Present teacher. Salvador. Sandra. Ah, ellos me dijeron que no están. Sandra y Víctor. Walter Daniel. William Eduardo. Yasmin Melanie. Okay. Walter Daniel said present in the chat. Okay, thank you guys. So let's learn about the use of so and such. Here we have some examples. I would like, let's see. Um, eh, let's see. Who, 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 Fatima, can you please read the examples with so? Okay. It is so necessary for the company. It is so important to check the reports. The projects were so well made. Ideas were so imaginative. Imaginative, yes. So as you notice, we use so, and then we have adjectives. For example, it is so necessary. It is so important. The projects were so well made. Uh, our ideas were so, so imaginative. So in this case, the word so gives emphasis. Emphasize, okay? Em it gives emphasis. It is so necessary. It's muy importante para la compañía. It is muy necesario para la empresa. It is so important to check the reports. Muy importante eh, chequear los reportes o evaluar los reportes. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Now, such. What is the meaning of such? We have so some examples much. here. Eh, Rocío, are you there? Are you there? Are you there? Ok, Rocío, can you please read the examples with such? Yes. It is such a creative program. It such a significant investment. The report was such a useful tool before. The last product was such a big success. Thank you, Rocio. Okay. Now, if you see here with the word such, it says it is such a creative program. It is such a significant investment. The report was such a useful tool. The last product was such a big success. So we have such and next to it, we have a noun phrase, una frase, right? Created program, significant investment, useful tool, big success. Tenemos una Noun phrase. Y esta frase, esta noun phrase, está hecha de un artículo, a creative, an adjective, and program, a noun, a creative program. Y 
And it's also to give emphasis. We can say the same, it is such a creative program, or we can say it is a, it is a program so creative. It is such a significant investment. It is, it is an investment so significant. O sea, lo podríamos convertir con el so también, pero el such le da en inglés, creo que en, en, en español, quizás no, no tenemos como una frase parecida. Para such. Uh -huh. o sea, que no hay, no hay forma de cómo sepamos. Cómo, ¿Cómo traducirlo en español, Ajá, porque es como bien americano. It is such a creative program. You are such great students. Son unos grandes alumnos, vea. O the well, um, today was such a great day. Hoy fue un gran día. Ajá. No, no hay como una traducción literal para eso. Teacher, este es el show. Sí, sí, se ocupa bastante eso, teacher. So, The last product was such a big success. El último producto fue un gran éxito, pero así como para dar un, un gran énfasis. Was such a pero big se, es como el mismo so, ¿verdad? Yeah, but we, the use is it. O sea, cómo lo estructuramos es diferente, ¿verdad? Porque usamos un noun phrase después de such. Y de so, después de so, usamos un adjetivo. Ok. Ah, ya okay. le entendí, ya ah, le entendí, ya, entendí, ya le entendí. Teacher, es que eh, en dado caso, show, so, sería so, como lo so, mismo. Es so. no, sí, pero creo que es cuando, cuando como el buen salvareña dice que depende, depende de la entonación de la voz, así, así es el significado de lo que está diciendo. Sería en como más, idioma, más, expres, más expresivo. Ajá, en, el, en, en nuestro idioma es como más. El, la entonación que le demos también, ¿verdad? Ajá, así como si yo sé, si, estoy, si lo digo, sabes que estoy tranquilo y lo digo muy fuerte porque estoy alterado, digamos. Uh, okay. Thank you, Domingo. Please eh, practice the pronunciation of such. 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 Ajá, en, los americanos, en inglés, They use, I mean, they, they like join the words. Ellos, ellos hacen eso, que, que juntan las palabras para hacer una sola. Mm -hmm. Cuando las such, pronuncian. It is such a creative program. It is such a creative program. It is such a significant investment. The report was such a useful tool before. The last product was such a big success. No, mm -hmm. no dicen así como, the last such product a. was such a, no, mm -hmm. you solo, ¿verdad? Such a big success. Such a. Such. Como help you. Exactly. How help can I you. help you? No, uh, how can I help you? Mm -hmm. How can I help you? How can I help you? Exactly. Como, como también, ¿verdad? Esa expresión de I love you. No decimos I love you. No creo que decimos de un solo, ¿verdad? I, I love, love you. you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love you. O... Oh, I like it. I like uh -huh. it. No, I like it. I like it. I like it. Or move it. Move it. Okay. I like to move it, move it. <laughs> like, <laughs> the song. like the song. Okay. The <laughs> Aquí les puse esa, esa imagen. What's the difference? What's the difference? We have so plus the adjective. Pretty. Example, pretty. she is so pretty. Ella es muy bonita. She's so pretty. Their house is so big. This is so amazing. Okay? Así es la forma correcta. So plus the adjective. So pretty, so big, so amazing. It's incorrect. It's incorrect to say she is so pretty woman. Ahí sí ya está incorrecto, porque tendría que decir she is such a pretty woman. Ahí okay. tendríamos que usar Richard, such. Siempre va a llevar such, o siempre va a ser una, no puede llevar un, 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 un como no, such an. Y si es plural, no va a llevar el artículo a, or an. Teacher. Yes. Y, y en, en, eso, entonces, 
Eh, por ejemplo, ahí dice, ella es bien bonita. Y es very, very pretty. Está bien. Very pretty. She is very pretty. Ajá. She is very uh, Ella es muy bonita. Es una, es una opción para expresar oh. más de lo, de lo... Muy, para decir muy. Pero cuando ah, usamos es? el so, es como todavía más, como para darle más realce o más... No se puede más decir, intenso. No se puede, no se puede decir, she is such a pretty, o sí. No. Bueno, she is such a pretty girl. Así ah. sí. Ajá, pero si usa el so, no. Ajá. She is so pretty, their, her, their house is so big, this is so amazing. This exam is so difficult. Mm -hmm. Such plus an plus adjective plus the noun. Correct. He is such a handsome man. They have such a big house. This is such an amazing idea. Algo difícil. No, Matías, it is not difficult. This no, is o sea, o sea, es que me refiero que es difícil de ya ponerlo en una oración que nosotros creemos una oración. Ya va a ver que no, ya va a ver que no. Sí, hasta creo que ya lo han usado antes. W question. Look at these examples to see how so such are used. Marco, can you please read the sentences? Pero así con la entonación, with the correct intonation. All right. Look at the example for, no, examples to see how so and such are used. She's you. so interesting. She's so interesting. She's so interesting. She is such, such an in, interesting book. A new phone, new phone costs so much money this day. Traffic in the city cent, center is such a nightmare. Okay. Nightmare. Thank you. She's so interesting. This is such an interesting book. A new phone costs so much money these days. Traffic in the city center is such a nightmare. Okay? You will hear this a lot in American conversations or in movies or TV programs. Now, uh, the meaning of nightmare. Nightmare. For example, mm -hmm. when you sleep at night and you are dreaming that someone is chasing you because wants to kill you, that is a nightmare. And you wake up, oh, thank God, thank God, that was just a nightmare. Pesadilla. It's the opposite of dream. It's not a dream. It was a nightmare. Lo contrario, dormir, teacher, o de soñar. No de soñar, o sea, un sueño bonito, ¿verdad? Pero un nightmare is not, it's not nice. Sí. We can use so and such to uh, intensify, intensify adjectives, intensify adverbs, and intensify nouns, examples. With a noun or adjective plus noun, we use such to make it stronger. For example, oh, you're such an angel because you helped me. It's such a hot day today. In San Miguel, right? Such a hot day today. They are such lovely trousers. Where did you buy them? Trousers. Trousers are like jeans. Similar to jeans, pants, pants. However, when we use much, many, little, and few with a noun, we use so to make it stronger. 
there are so many people here. I have so little time to myself this week. I had so little time to myself. Entonces, cuando vamos a utilizar esos, esos quantifiers como much, many, little, and few with a noun, vamos a usar so. There are so many people here. I have so little time. Much, someone. We can also use this expression so and such to say that the result of something. We often use these so and such structures with that and a close to say what the result is. Example, it was so cold, estaba tan helado, it was so cold that the water in the lake froze. Estaba tan helado que el agua en el lago se congeló. He was such a good teacher that we all passed the exam. Él era tan buen maestro que todos pasamos el examen. There's so much noise that I can't think. Hay tanto ruido que no puedo pensar. Entonces eso lo utilizamos para expresar intensidad o para hacerlo algo con más énfasis o más, con más fuerza. ¿Sí? Más entonado. Y tiene mucho que ver de intonación. Yes, it has a lot to do with it. So much Ready to practice? I can do. Okay, now here we have some exercises. First, read the exercises, copy the exercises in your notebook, please, and write if it's so or such. Identify if it is so or such, okay? Please, everybody, write in your notebook, write the exercise, if it's not in your book. Okay. I want such not so many so much such talking. Okay. So hard to work. I am finished. Did you copy all of them? Yes. Yo le imprimo, teacher. Ah, so you just wrote it. So or such. But we are going to give some time to the uh, students who are copying, okay? Who are okay. taking notes. Okay. What was that? Hey guys, how is the, the soccer match going? La Selecta is winning. 
Is La Selecta winning or losing? Win. Losing. I don't know, teacher. Winning. Win. Winning. Winning, really? How many goals? One goal. One. Okay, nice. But we are winning. Yes, that's great. Okay, so let's see. With number one, what is the correct expression? So or such? So, such. 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 Okay, who would like to read with the with Oh my God, so. what was that? Oh. There are so many things. Oh. <laughs> oh. So many things. So, it was... It was such a big noise. <laughs> but I can't identify where it comes from. It's a mysterious. Ah, you are you are watching the game. That's why. Okay, so the first it was such a beautiful painting that she decided to hang it on, to hang it in. I no puedo ver, chicos, lo que dice. In the living room. Okay, so it was such a beautiful painting. Very good. Number two. There are. So, exactly, very good. I sorry. There are there are so many things. Okay, there are so many things to do before we move house. Okay, number three, you plan this is a so so much. Oh. Exactly. So much. So much more carefully this time. Well done. You planned this essay so much more carefully this time. Well done. Number four, it's. Oh. It's such. it's such a hassle when you lose your wallet with all the things you have to cancel and replace. Okay, number five, it was so, so kind. It was so kind of him to help me that I bought him some flowers to say thank you. Okay, number six, I thought this season was so. So, so much, much better. better. So much better than the last. I watched all the episodes in one weekend. And number seven, I never had so such hard work. Such, such yeah, hard working students before. ¿Por qué? Porque después de hard working tenemos un noun students. No hay un article porque es plural. Okay. I never had such hardworking students before and so intelligent. Number eight, they go to their local restaurant. So, 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 so,
No entendí. So, regularly that all the staff know their names. They go to their local restaurants so regularly that all the staff know their names. Okay? So, child working. More exercises. Yes, teacher, because we are hardworking. <laughs> you have to complete the sentences with so or such and then compare with a partner, okay? More exercises, please. Finish. Nice. Uh, Matias, the place yes. where you work, do they print the um, stickers? Yes. Ooh. Are they expensive or do they have a good price? It depends. It depends. Mm -hmm. Okay. I would like some stickers to put on. Have you seen those uh, boxes when you buy a piece of cake or when you buy like tres leches in the supermarket or in the bakery? Those ¿Cuántos quieres? Those boxes. Sí, pero ¿cuál, ¿qué cantidad quieres? Like 60. Like 60 stickers or 50. 60, 70. Uh -huh. 50 or 60. I'm not sure about the number, but around 50 or 60. Right in the chat. Right in the chat. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good. Good, Matias. Okay, guys, number one. It is good to know the cash flow. They are? So, so important. Very good. So important. Yes. The architect is? Such a creative such woman. A creative such a creative woman. woman. Wireless internet access is? So convenient. So, so convenient. convenient. So convenient. And more so convenient. when you are taking English classes online. All the inventions we created are so popular. So popular. So, popular. So, popular. so so. Why? Because so. we only have an adjective. The computer was such. Checking your financial statement was so difficult, so difficult before. before. So difficult before. Very good. You see, easy, easy peasy. It's like a piece of cake. Is it very good? Apareció. Ya cayó. Ok, 
Ok. Ya terminó el partido. Sí, pero ya regresó. The game is finished. Hay que sacar la frente. It's game. Ok. Pero el resultado. I never. <laughs> Okay, guys, now it's your turn to make a conversation. But I think that talking about financial, what, what are you, I mean, let's change. I mean, it, it's going to be related to, to uh, financial matters, but I would like you in your conversations uh, created about uh, the economic situation in our country. Okay? For example, you can say, uh, nowadays, buying food is so expensive. Like, like saying, saying things like that, okay? Or the electricity bills are so high or saying um, using the Chihuahua wallet is so difficult or is so easy, okay? No puede ser de la empresa. Yeah, it could be about your company or it could be about the economic situation in general in your, uh -huh. but the important thing is that you use so and that you use such. Mm -hmm. Okay, for sure. example, I can say, my example. mom is such a, a good organizer with the money. Uh, Woman. For one example, and in the company, they are so uh, stinking, stingy. 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 <laughs> okay. Okay, Matias. <laughs> yeah, I mean the, the thing is that you that you use so and such. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so do it with your partner. But if you want, you can even talk about the class. This topic is so, this is so cha class. This is such a fantastic class. We uh, learn so much. I have a question. Uh, in the company, they are, como puedo ocupar el such? Después, en vez de esto. This is such a stingy company. Mm, I no le pondría, no le poner in the company they are so such stingy, verdad? No, I tendría que usar el so. The, uh -huh. Uh -huh, the company is so stingy. Pero para decirlo, para utilizarlo, entonces el such tendría que ser this this such thing in the, in the company the company uh, the this, com uh -huh. the such thing the company no 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 this is oh oh my workplace my workplace is such a stingy company okay 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 excellent no <laughs>
everything is clear. It's so difficult because most of the company just offer the minimal salary teacher. Can I say minimal salary, salario mini? Minimum, the minimum salary. So to get a high salary is so difficult nothing. This is difficult to get a, a good a good job or, or a good salary. Mm. It's difficult to mm, get all all thing for your house or for your, yeah. your family. Yeah, and the cost of the energy, the, the electricity, sorry, and also water, uh, internet, it is uh, too high. And the and the money that we get in the in our job is not is not enough to pay all all of this. Um, it is so little, right? It is so little. Yeah. Yeah. Also, the food. Things now are so expensive. The other day I went to the supermarket and I was like very surprised because I spent $35 in a few things. And before, I mean, I bought the same like with $20 or $23. I spent $30, I think it was like $33 or $35. And I was like, wow. Yeah. Seems two years, I think. Uh, when the things that I that I, that I could bought buy I could buy that I could buy with seventy dollar now I have to spend to spend around one hundred fifty the double yeah the double the double yes it's true then the food is so expensive yeah <laughs> this is so sad <laughs> <laughs> also the education right now is so expensive because yes, the education is so expensive in Greece, a lot of when because, you have kids mm -hmm, send mm -hmm. Sending uh, kids to school. Yeah, to explain. Yeah, so, this is this is such a hard life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, maybe if you don't write a conversation, but maybe you can write some sentences. Okay, using so and such in your group. Okay, good. Thanks. Hello. You are so quiet, guys. Why? Because we waiting in the chat. We are writing, teacher. Oh, you're writing. But I think the economic situation in the country is so difficult. It is, I agree with you. It's so difficult to find a job and the economy gets more complicated. Yeah, for some, yeah, there are many people who don't have a job and they can't find one. Or if they have a job, 
they don't uh, earn enough money because the salaries are so low. <laughs> Domingo says, my financial status is a borderline. <laughs> it's on the limit. It's on the limit. Okay. Solo ando buscando las ofertas, Ria. I am looking for the offers for the sales. I do the same to economize. I mean, <laughs> to save some money. <laughs> when I go to the supermarket, I, for example, the section of the meats, I only buy the meats that are on sale. Stay. Okay, guys, if you don't write a conversation, but at least write some sentences using so and such, okay? So and such. So and such. Okay. I will be, I, no, we will be in an increase, increase of the capital gain mm -hmm. on, we will be, sorry, we will be in an increase. Okay, guys, if you don't finish the conversation, but at least write some sentences using so and such, okay? Okay. Yeah, we use one time. <laughs> uh, si quiera la, escu la escucha hasta donde la llevamos ahorita, teacher. Okay. Ahorita vamos empezando. Hi, Marco. Hi. Can I ask you something? Has, ask you something. Can I ask you? Ask. Can I ask you? Uh -huh. Can I ask you something? Yes. Uh, what of do you course. think? You can say. Yes, of course. Of course, no problem. Sure. Okay. What do you think of the country's economy? Oh, it's so interesting. Interesting. I think that, interesting. Interesting. I think that country economic is on the correct way because the new system economic employer, employer will be in uh, increase of the capital gain. Oh, he, uh, do you agree with the use of Bitcoin? Como? Do you agree with the use of Bitcoin? Yeah, it's so interesting. So it's interesting. It's such an interesting uh, system. It is such an interesting... It is such an interesting... It's such an interesting system. system. Mm -hmm. But there was a part of the conversation that I think you were using Spanglish. Spanglish. <laughs> or, or like literal translation. Can you repeat? Please. Uh, Hi, Marco. Hi. Uh, can I ask you something yes of course uh, what do you think of the country's economy about the country economy yes oh yes it's so interesting okay 
right there, Marco, why don't you, why don't you say better? That is such an interesting question. Come on. That, uh... that is such an interesting question or that is such an interesting topic. That that is that is so such, 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 such an interesting question. Oh, uh -huh. that is such an interesting question. You're sleeping. No, I'm just tired. I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, I'm not sleepy at all. Believe me, other days I've been more sleepy, but not today. <laughs> that is such an interesting question. An interesting question. Okay. Y de ahí se decís lo demás vos. I think, I think that country economic is... Okay, the country's economy. Okay. The country's economy. No economic, porque es economic, economic es económico. Y usted quiere decir la economía del país. Uh -huh, the uh -huh. country's economy. The country's economy. Uh -huh. The country's economic. No, economy. Economy, economy. Con tilde en la economy. No, 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 con acento. No, no, acento, no, ajá, no, con entonación en la onomi. Onomi, the country's economy. This on the correctly way. In the correct way. Do you agree with the use of Bitcoin? Espérame, 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 que me perdí ahí. Sí. Y puse, eh, because the new system economic employee. Okay. Because... No, it's such, it's such an interesting system. Okay, because the new, eh, eh, the new economic system implemented Teacher, pero ahí no vamos a poder meter la SOCH. Y estamos intentando... Economic system. Because the new economic system implemente... Es que ahí usted quería empleado, quiere, quiere decir, ¿verdad? Ajá, como el sistema de empleado, o sea, empleado como que... Se... Que se está usando, que se ha usado. Ah, por eso es implemented, implemented. Implementado, a implementar. Okay. Mm -hmm. Implemented. Because the new economic system implemented by the government, by the government, by, by the government. Mm -hmm. By the government. Para ponernos, nos lleva en el camino correcto. Nos lleva. We. Um, we take. Um, oh. Porque le había puesto. We. We, up. we will be. An increase. Increase of the capital gain. Como que nos va a llevar a. A. a a un incremento de, de, del capital o de un incremento de... Uh -huh. Ok, okay. Uh, the new economic system implemented by the government will help us, help us, help us, will help us increase our, our incomes. Nos va a ayudar a incrementar nuestros ingresos. Will help us increase our incomes. You know, in incomes. Y luego va lo que tú dijiste. Que si había... Tim, do you agree with the use of Bitcoin?
they buy it such an interesting system. Yes, it's a so such, such, a, such an interesting system. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, it's a such a interesting system. It's such, it's such, it's such, it's such, a, such, it's such a, an interesting system. An interesting. Beginning with interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, guys. Can you give me some of your examples? Can you tell me some of your examples, please? Yes, Carlos. Yeah. And then Domingo. Mm. Uh, the financial statements is so important for the companies. Okay. There okay. are so many candies for you. Oh, there are so <laughs> many candies for me. Thank you. <laughs> Domingo? Uh, as, as all two sentences, uh, well, um, for example, my financial status is too borderline. Y después hice una que decía, pero no sé si está bien hecha. I buy, I buy, yo compro, I buy the su good book shoes, I check. Quise poner, compro lo muy bueno, pero barato. Pero muy, pero bien barato. Ok, I buy, um, I buy good, good things, but so cheap. So cheap. No es chupo, sino que chupo. Chip. ¿Your examples, Matías? Example de que chupo. Your example sentences. ¿La conversación? Uh -huh. ¿Con Marco? Okay. Okay. You ready? Marco? Yeah, I'm ready. Hi, Marco. Hi. Uh, can I ask ask you something? Yes, of course. Go ahead. Oh, what do you think of the country's economy? That it's a uh, that is such an interesting question. The country economic and the the country economic and the correct way because the new economic system implemented implemented by the government will will have have will have help has in increase or incomes. Oh, uh, do you agree with the use of Bitcoin? Yes, it uh, it suits an interesting system. 
All right. Thank only that. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, I don't know, maybe Alfredo or Nancy or Rocío or Fatima or Alba or William or Walter or Marlon or Maydeli. <laughs> we are waiting for your examples too. Um, I think the the economic is bad in our country. The minimum is so low. Uh, it's not sufficient. So basic break. Okay, so the economy system in in our country is so difficult because the the salaries are so low okay very good thank you Alfred. okay guys because of the time we are going to stop here but tomorrow we are going to continue with the exercises that i have prepared for you for the last activity okay but i know it's almost it's almost 10 so I'm just going to, I, I just want to ask you guys. So what is the structure of the use of so? How do you use so? We use so plus adjective Ad or noun phrase? Adjective. Adjective. And we use such with? Noun phrase. With a noun phrase. What is a financial? Can you give me examples of financial statements? Examples. Cash flow. Balance sheet. Uh, a quality statement. Equity statement, incomes, okay, good. Very good. Okay, guys, now I will take your tenants, the last one. Hey, Alba Dinora, Alfredo Alexander. Present teacher. Amir Carcañengues. Carlos Walberto. Present. Cristina Romero. Domingo Alexander. Present. Fátima Portillo. Present. José Matías Lemus. Marlon Cardona. Mauricio Majano. My Deli Judith, Nancy Rodriguez, Present Teacher, Rocío Martinez, Present Teacher, Salvador Escobar, bueno, Sandra, Victor, eh, Walter Daniel, William Eduardo, y eh, Jasmine Melan. Teacher, I remind you, don't call me. Who? Marco David. A quien no llame. Hello. Marco. Yeah. <laughs> Where is it? Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much for staying here in this class and for your participation. Um, today was the turn of Sandra, but she didn't connect in this class. So if somebody wants to stay, I'm going to be here for 10 minutes. Okay. If not, there's no problem. You can go to bed and rest. All right. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow is Friday. Tomorrow. Have a beautiful night. You too. Good night. Well, good night. Good night.